Hello and welcome to episode 23 of The Legend of Zelda The Minish Cap. Today we're doing part 2 of the Palace of Winds. Last time we got to about the halfway point. Today we're going to go ahead and finish off this dungeon. Collect ourselves an element. Go ahead and hop down here. And be careful. Ah. Yikes! No, you jerk! What I'm trying to do is knock him off. I mean, this works too, I guess. Ah, oh, that worked. You can push him off if you get him right next to the edge. Yeah, you can actually give him a little little bump, and he goes flying off. <clears throat> How much farther do we have to go? This place goes on forever. You're telling me, Oslo. Uh, there's no point in complaining about it. We must press onward. After all, how much more could there be? Plenty. This is a pretty big dungeon. Uh, up there is a key that we need to get. So go ahead. Let's see what else is around here. Uh, right. If you're so inclined, up here is the compass. Screw off, pal. Alright, go ahead and switch over. S completely ignoring those guys because I don't want to deal with them. I don't want to deal with this either, so I'm just going to go. Uh, no, 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 no! Okay, that works. Go ahead and get this key. Hop back down. And we're going right back up where we were just now. Not a fan of those guys. the gust jar out. Well, I do want that, though. If I can still get it, it's not too late. Might be too late. Oh, well. Yeah, the heart's gone. Okay. Well, that sucks. We have to be careful here, because we need to go in between... I think we're okay. There we go. And... Okay. Get ourselves another key here. Guess you can't fly off ledges. That's weird. Oh well. Oh. Guess you gotta... Really? Oh my god! That wasn't annoying at all. Just so you know. If you touch those guys, they'll explode, so... Just gotta be a little bit careful. Completely ignoring the Gibdos. Thank you very much. I guess we'll ignore the bats as well. I lost so many hearts with that stupid fight. I mean, falling in the hole. We have a regular whiz robe and a f freeze robe. This brings us back over 
to uh, that side of the room. I hate these guys. We can jump. We're just going to go ahead and jump down. Alright, I'm going to sneeze, so I'm sorry. Alright, I think we weren't supposed to fall down here. So let's head back upstairs. And it's okay because we opened up this little path. So we can just come back up. I think we're supposed to go up again. Yes. And then this time we go right. Now don't eat it. Don't eat it. We got some heat robes. Oh yeah. Here we have the map. I mean, it's so weird they give you the map like at the end of the level, but whatever. Go away. Avoidance is the best strategy sometimes. Yeah, like I'm, except for these guys because they're they're just they're just obnoxious. So, I might have to kill that Gibdos as well. Definitely gonna kill this jerk. Bite me. These are not pushable. The other one is. I might have to get rid of this Gibdos. That didn't kill him? Oh, I was gonna say. Better. I think that's the best strategy for the Gibdos. All they want is a hug. Give me a hug. Here we finally get to make it all the way down here for the piece of heart that we saw in the last episode. Dang. Nope, I guess we have to fall and do this again. That's okay. It was worth it, piece of heart. Alright, this time. Oh, really? I have to kill you again? I'm glad I I'm glad I jumped into you. Freaking stupid respawning A. Hey, freaking respawning enemies. There's nothing I hate more in the world. All right, if you hit that guy right over there, of course he'll go ahead and um, and explode. If you want, I think it's just a green rupee or a red rupee, like a giant rupee. I don't remember. I obviously don't need the money, but I do want to see what it is. Yeah, red rupee. Kind of a waste. Too bad. Ugh, freaking give those. Go away. Stop following me. and light these up. This is going to give us a teleporter. We also don't need it, but it's good to have in case we die or something. Oh, freaking give those.
Nope. It's just easier to get rid of them. I, you don't have to. You can just go on with your life, but... This next room is heck. I hate this room. That's okay. Okay. Um, how do we want to do this? I think we're going to lay a bomb and then not quite go all the way out. Do it that way. And then... Oh, I think I was not supposed to hit it. Yeah, that was dumb, huh? So the trick is to not hit it. I see. Okay, we'll try that again. A little, just a little side, side wards. Look at that. Professional. You get a small key. Ugh, freaking stupid. That's all right. So you can see the, the boss door right there. We're getting closer. There we go. And then... Eh. A lot of switching back and forth. Alright, this room is also a nightmare. Oh, are you serious? He'll pay for that. The red ones are the worst, I think. They're the ones that annoy me the most. They're stupid spinning. I'm waiting for that fire robe to come back so I can give him a piece of my mind. Oh, Moblins. Never stop being stupid. All right. Ugh, this is gonna be a pain. Ugh, seriously? I hate you. Ah, I just got that heart back too. Bye. Wilkinstone piece action, if you're interested. Really? I don't think I stood on that long enough for it to break. How'd you guys get way over there? I don't think I want to go that way yet. I do want to go this way, though. Let's go ahead and kill that guy if I can, though. Well, whatever. What I need to do is push these blocks. Oh, and fall right off. I meant to push the block, not walk off the edge. Okay. That's how it's going to be. We'll do it this way, then. I don't know why they have to make these so tall. Like we get it, we're high up in the sky. Goodness. Wow, wow, wow. This part of the episode is brought to you by professionalism. There we go. 
Oh, it's not what I expected. This went pear-shaped quickly. <laughs> I thought it was going to be the flying skulls again. But no. Kinstone piece, not worth it. But land on the platform, thankfully. Alright, if you want to go back, for whatever reason, I don't want to go back because I don't want to deal with those red skulls again. All right, we're getting there. Um, I think we're good to go. Give myself a little heart action. All right, so this next boss, uh, basically, we're gonna have to jump around a lot and transform ourselves into multi-link in different patterns to kill it. So, uh. Yeah, that's basically how this is going to go. So, uh, let's do it. As is the way of things, this is going to be a multi-phase fight, so... Just be ready for it. Alright, this is an easy enough pattern. I was supposed to jump on that comeback. Son of a gun. Here we go. Ah, oh, man. Ah, that was too quick, man. Gotta give me a little more time. I finished exploding, sir. Rude. Ah, oh, this is gonna be annoying, isn't it? Dang it! I waited too long. Yeah, this is how this is gonna go. We gotta hurry. No, I gotcha. There we go. Alright, this is a weird pattern, but we can do this. Nice. Really? Because I touched, barely touched her tail. Uh. Here we go again. Now he's going to be shovey. That's so annoying. I wonder if I can knock those things back at him. Nope. Just curious. Get in there, Link. Oh my god. So annoying. Let me jump on your stupid back. There we go. <sighs> All right, finally. Oh my God. 
<laughs> this guy's annoying. That's what I would say about him. This should be the last one, though. Took a lot of damage. I'm actually really disappointed in myself. It's mostly the blue guy, too. So that was Georg, red and blue. And then the mini green Georgs. Cool, we got the wind element. The wind carries the seeds of flowers, scattering life across the land. The wind element is the embodiment of that power. Get ourselves a piece of heart. And... At last, we got all four elements. Let's go revive the sacred blade. Let's! But we're going to do that next time, because I'm out of time for now. Thank you for joining me for another episode of the Minish Cap. In the next episode, we're going to go ahead and take care of some stuff. Um, including some, uh, some side stuff, like a new sword technique and a couple of heart pieces and such. Um, in addition... Yeah, I'm gonna. In addition, I'm gonna go ahead and go back to the figurine shop, trade in some of these stupid seashells. So I'll probably get and try to do that between episodes. Because again, we need to do all the stupid figurines to get a piece of heart. And the more enemies you encounter, the more chances you have to get a figurine that you don't have. So, anyway, thank you for joining me for this episode, and I'll catch you guys next time. <laughs>